Okay. But let's cross over to the Makola market where Johnny Hughes is also on standby. The President of the Republic, in lifting the three-week lockdown, had announced that businesses could go on. We have come here this morning to find out how business is booming, whether or not the market women are raking in cash, whether they are buyers for those, the wares that they are selling, and what other issues. And this morning, we've been met with a bit of crowd, if you will, even though we understand that yesterday was a thicker crowd. And there you see, in your shot right now, the disregard for social distancing, which has been a very, very big issue. We've seen a few of the market women wear their own masks, and we would want to find out from them what really is the state of business here. As you can tell, a few of the market women are already uh, lying down idle, I'd want to find out from them what exactly is happening. Uh, Auntie, Auntie Nette is saying good morning. Good morning. Now, who mask is going? I'm tough for more. I'm crying. My brain poor. Now then, I would. I'm not. I'm not proud of you. Mad then, I would. I'm not paying my buy. I'm not paying my buy. Market is nice slow. It is fifty man. They are not buying. It's not nice here. Market is nice slow. I'm not buying. Yeah, we are putting away inside. We are so if inside we are not buying. I'm not buying. So essentially what she's telling us is that since Monday that they've been out here trying to make ends meet, uh, the people come out anyway, but buying their wares has been uh, absent, if, if you like, literally for them. And also they are raising concerns about the fact that they have stuff for church and other special occasions that are not being looked at. And even for those that could be for the everyday knock about or knock around, uh, really is also not being bought. So they are saying that they have been here, but nobody is buying what they are what they are selling. Madam Edasipa, let me try and find out. I see this gentleman is trying to buy something. Chief, good morning. How are you? I'm fine. You. Why is your mask on your chin? Because I'm talking to the customer because he didn't hear anywhere. That's why. Okay. So you you sell, but where's the customer? This is the customer. Yes. Okay. Let me speak with the customer. Chief, are you buying? Yes, boss. I... What are you buying? The people said you are not buying. Where are they buying? Is where? Okay. Israel and uh, Stepa one. Okay. Uh, Are you a footballer? No, no, no. I'm say I'll be, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be businessman. You'll be businessman. Okay. Yes. So you are buying to go and sell. Sell, yeah. I'm from who? Okay. Oh, so you came all the way from who? Yeah, yeah, yeah. To come and buy here. Buy, yes. And, and so far, how has it been like for you being around here? Uh, see, the, the people know they buy like that. The police don't make busy like this, so they just come buy one to one to because you know we we'll visit for house. Okay. See. Uh -huh. But you're not wearing a mask, why? Uh, my mask is in my bag inside. It's supposed to be on your face. Why is it in, in your bag? <laughs> it be so, it be so, boss. I'll forget. Uh, it be so. Well. Uh, we'll make you well. Okay. Make you stay safe. Chief, but you, you are lucky. Somebody is buying from you. Yeah, you see, though the lockdown is lifted, but many people are afraid to come to work because of the distance they are talking about. Distance. Yes. Okay. So many people are expecting some people to come before they will get information to also come. Okay. You understand? So me, when I come, yes, I come and notice that the market is not moving well. But I can't tell my friends to also stay home. Mm. I just tell them, let's all come together. Let's try because we'll get something small. Okay. Because once we are at home, we are crying for money. Mm. We are saying that there's no food. So if it has been lifted, it's an opportunity for us. We can come and do one or two things. The small thing you get, we don't know. Maybe lift, lift down can come again. We can use that thing to part ourselves and maintain ourselves a little bit. Okay. That's how it comes. Okay. So now... I am looking at the stretch here. It's usually more crowded than it, it is now. I, is it the case that you guys are observing social distancing? Because I see a lot more people cramped up as well. What, what's happening with social distancing? Okay. Once it's a marketplace, you can't say that there will be a social distance. But all that you have to do is that you yourself have to be careful so that you won't contact anybody and other things. For the social distancing, you can't do it in the market. Because definitely people will come. But, but you're supposed to have, for example, Veronica buckets that, that yeah. people can wash their hands. Do you have it? We have pipe, we have bowls, we have everything at the back there. Okay. So when you finish buying, we take you there. Okay. You wash your hands and then we'll try to give you some nose marks and other things. Okay. So that maybe if you don't have it, you can use it 
when you go to different places. Okay. Yes. And, and I've just spotted a Veronica bucket in front of a shop here. Maybe I'll go and ask. I'll go and ask what exactly is happening there. But you're live on TV3 New Day. And this is uh, an audit of what the market situation is out here today. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning. And this is first, no, but uh, yeah, it's normal. And kaka kaka. Hmm. I know I should also ye. All right. So that's the sent. These are the sentiments out there. I am concerned about the conditions of social distancing out here. But from the central business district here in Accra, my name is Johnny. He's on behalf of the rest of the team. But well, thank you for watching. See you soon.